Hey guys, it's Viewmasters Reactions, and this came out a couple hours ago. It is the extended scene at the diner where he's tormenting the waitress from Brightburn. If you saw, I've reacted to at least two, maybe three trailers for Brightburn already. It looks really good. I definitely want to see it in theaters, but it's not the type of movie where I'm like, well, I don't want spoilers because this, this, and this. Like, I don't want to know the ending or anything, but I don't mind watching scenes like this. I'm sure there's a hundred of them, and they're not going to show their best stuff. At least I would hope they wouldn't show their best stuff. So this came out a couple hours ago. I'm curious to see how dark and violent they get. It looks like it's going to be a dark, violent movie. He looks like a tormented young soul. So we're going to jump right in, guys. Red Band Graphic. Red Band Graphic. Extended Red Band Brightburn movie clip diner scene. Here we go. The thing that sucks is she seems like she's nice. Maybe she's a horrible person. Let's imagine she's a horrible person. She put too much butter on his pancakes this morning, and that deserves death. All right, so he's in there somewhere. Why are the windows so dirty or cloudy looking? Why are the windows even like Is that you, Gary? Hey. That's the girl from Bad Santa. Right? Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. It kind of looks like the girl from Bad Santa. Uh, I don't know about. Mm, I hate anything near my eye. Oh my god, it looked like it just sl <laughs> That was much more graphic than I imagined as far as that scene. Oh my god, that was deep in her eye. Like, she must have done something. Why would the kid just torment her for no reason? Uh, I hurt. Why would they have a lock on the inside of a freezer? That's interesting. That would be terrifying. All right, well, that made sense. It basically started the scene right where it did in the trailer and ended the scene where it did in the trailer, but added like three minutes of detailed stuff. It didn't show a whole lot more except how deep that glass went in her eye. That definitely was deeper and more extended on that scene. The rest was just like him flashing around a bit, showing more of the laser eye thing than we saw on the original trailer. What I don't get is... Don't get me wrong, I think it looks amazing and I dig it, but did he really need to laser beam the door in half? It looks to me like he could just blast through the door or rip the door off the hinges with ease. 
So the whole laser beam eye thing was just for effect. A little unnecessary. I loved it. It looks amazing. I just thought it was funny. It's like you took all that time to laser beam the door. He could like probably flick that whole building down without even a hesitation. So a little bit much, but it definitely scared the shit out of her and makes for good effects. So you guys let me know what you think. I'm definitely going to see this in theaters opening night. So comments down below, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.